Felis pendens. That's a Latin phrase um, which is translated into English as certificate of pending litigation. And what it means is you are, by registering this thing, you are saying to anybody who looks at title, you're saying, I have a right to some sort of interest in this land. Now, the interest I might have in the land might be different things. I might have an interest in land because I have an unregistered mortgage or because I have a lease which entitles me to stay in this land or it could be any number of reasons why you might have an interest in the land. But what you're saying is, with the certificate of pending litigation, you're, what you're saying is, I have a lawsuit going to assert an interest in this land. So you better be careful about, <laughs> about buying it or dealing with it without taking into account me. That would have been the normal thing for the buyer to do, except that the buyer didn't want the land. <laughs> The buyer actually had no interest in buying the land anymore, at least not at the price agreed. So that made it very, um, very strange to think of getting a certificate of pending litigation. And I actually told them that when they threatened to get a certificate of pending litigation. I said, you've got no interest in this land. You can't get a certificate of pending litigation. So what they did is something else. They registered something called a caution. You can register practically anything as a caution. Basically, a caution is just you're, you're warning the world of something. Uh, and in the caution itself, it should give some sort of clue as to what it's about.